I'm talking with Mike at Premier Pet Supply. And you know, Mike, a lot of us have been struggling with creating a routine while we're at home. But part of the problem, you know, we've seen those videos of meteorologists whose dog jumps into the shot or people in Zoom meetings where the cat just kind of strolls by behind them. Our pets are with us all day while we're working. You have got some tricks up your sleeve though to keep our pets occupied. Yeah, it's really important always to keep them stimulated mentally and also really busy, um, utilizing that energy that they have so that you also have a little peace of mind, you know, or, or some, some time so you can, you know, collect, you know, your thoughts and do the things that are important to you, especially if there's work meetings and things like that. So. Some of the things we've always recommended doing are um, giving them puzzles to work on. Oh! So, so things like this, there's all different levels of puzzles. These are really fun. How, how does that puzzle work? So some are more challenging than others. Like this one in particular, what's pretty cool is that um, by flipping or sliding and moving the different pieces that are on here, they actually, um, you put treats underneath there. It all how much time does that buy you? There's different levels of okay. puzzles. Some are a little more difficult than others. Some the dogs can master very quickly. Others, it could be something that, you know, could be 15 minutes to a half hour. Oh, um, that's pretty good. Yeah, one thing that I really like always have is called, it's called the kibble nibble. What's pretty neat about this is that this opens, and what you can do is you can put an entire meal inside here. No way. The dog can see it, they can smell it, they can hear it. Um, they just can't get to it very easily without rolling it around and nudging it throughout the house. It's got rubber around the edges so it doesn't cause damage. It, is, it gives them an opportunity to actually have work for their food and for their meal. Is it noisy? It, it can be, and so maybe if you're on a meeting or doing something that is, you know, work-related, like a phone call, have them in another room with it, um, because as it rolls around on a hardwood floor, it can be noisy for sure. But Yeah, but absolutely, it would keep them distracted. Now, we can't forget about our cats. Uh, you, you beat me to the punch, so <laughs> having different types of toys for them. You know, you could easily be on a meeting and, and, and do one of these with your cat, <laughs> throw it around and, you know, keep them busy. It's, it's actually something that's entertaining. It can be something that... Um, <laughs> Again, what is that? So this is actually one of the, like, there's so many different types of teaser ones. This one's really, really cute. It's got little sushi rolls on it. I was wondering. That is adorable. It is. Yeah, there's a lot of fun things like this for them. There's laser pointers. There's ones sure. that actually have uh, toys that move within that keep the cats busy. So there's a lot of options for both the dogs and the cats, keeping them busy while you're busy as well. Absolutely. Keep them stimulated. Try to find your routine. We're just all getting used to uh, definitely a new schedule. Thanks so much, Mike. Yeah, thank you, Priya.